and Brownie. It's a podcast bonus. Straight oh, up. Oh, God, we're so excited. <laughs> we got the Queen here. Kate oh. Langbrook, a comedian, writer, television presenter and radio lady, in which she was the very first person to speak on Nova when oh. it began. Can we talk? Okay, it had to be you to be the first person to speak on air. It was going to be me. That being in 2001, in the very studio she's sitting in right now. And I bet you she feels right at home, as we'd have no aesthetic or technological upgrades <laughs> since that day. <laughs> Kate's book, Chow Bella, is out now. Here's Langbrook. Oh, Lady Lang, oh, what Return of the Queen. Like. Return Whoa, of the Queen. Can you, out of exile... Is this the first time you've been into this studio yes, since you it's left? it's the first time. Well, and you left in disgrace. Yeah, okay. <laughs> we left in disgrace. You were frog oh, marched yeah. out Yeah, of here. that's mm. right. There was security handed me my box. What has changed? Hello. What's wrong with you? <laughs> what has God. changed? Absolutely nada. Except, mm. no, I tell a lie, in reception, yeah. they've lowered... They've lowered the reception desk. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they used to have that classic setup with the receptionist, so you couldn't yeah. see the receptionist. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh st- mm. that, that time when it was supposed to be better to stand to work. I think so. Yeah, it must yeah. have been. Right. But Swanee and I have hugged. We have hugged so many times just outside this door. Mm. Because I was working That's at, so at, uh, the, at the equivalent was... of Smooth at the time. Mm. Oh, yeah. So yes. we saw each other every yes. morning. Yeah. The radio station that dare not speak its name. It was a great Great thrill. Yeah. Which one's that? Oh, Vega. Yeah, yeah Vega. 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 Neil sounded a bit flat that you were the first one to speak. Oh, he would have been. You know what he's like. What, <laughs> hey, what was know. he like to work with? Those well, Because he comes he, in on a Friday. When Sam's not here on a Friday, Dave comes in. And yes. Well, well you mean when Sam's jokes. not here on a Friday, a Monday, a Wednesday, yeah, occasionally. Yeah, that's a right. Why are you telling me? Stay days. down, Pang. I'm just, I'm just talking truth. It's a truth bomb. Hey, Got a sound effect for that, Dino? I'll, I'll find one. Hey, real quick. Yeah. When, when Dave O'Neill broke his leg, tell us all about that. Oh, my goodness. Well, I wasn't there because it was at the other radio. Oh, Were shit. you there yeah. for that, Swanee? My bad. Forget I wasn't the there either. I'd been fired. So who was oh, there? was it just him and Dicko? <laughs> yeah, it was just him was and Dicko. He did it on purpose then. <laughs> 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 just to get a couple of weeks off. Uh, yeah, yeah. Hey, Touchdown. Ciao, Ciao, Bella. We've got to talk about this beautiful book. Oh, my darling. Yeah, you've been hustling it for a couple of months now. Well, you, you know what happened? Well, I have been, actually, because I wrote a book about our two years in Italy, mm. right? Mm. And it came out just before Christmas. But just before Christmas, it was it was a shice and show. I was supposed to come on this show. Yeah. You got, I got COVID. Then you I got, got COVID. COVID. Yeah. Have you had COVID? Yeah, yes. it, was, yeah, it was my fault. I was the first oh, one to start right. it. You were at the COVID party yes. with your wife. The key well, party. It's funny that because we. <laughs> the, the, it was, yeah, in the bowl. So really? few, uh, I, I'm not sure whether it was that or a mate's 40th a couple of days later, but uh, there was quite a few people got it from that mm. venue. Yeah, right. But I, was in the, I was in the Herald Sun yeah. while I was in the lineup. Yeah. Of the testing, you know, you go and get the, uh, oh, what's it's it called, the PCR. Oh, yeah. Before you entered, did you? Before I entered, I was, I, was going through, I was going through the Herald Sun website and, and there it said my name and I tested positive for COVID and I hadn't even had the test yet. Oh, what? Well, because I played golf with Sam. Oh, uh, yeah, whatever. I've lost yeah, it. I, I know, I lost it. <laughs> and I took, I, took, I, took a rat, I took a rat test and I rang Sam. Yeah, well, yeah, and great. I rang Sam and said, great. mate, I think we might have... Do you know what? Put this in the podcast. Have... No. <laughs> because this Put is in Brownie's podcast. Stuff. Let's we talk will. about He's your book, shall we? Me. Um, <laughs> it is called Ciao Bella. It is magnificent. You... Took your family over to Italy for two years. It was only supposed to be yes, one, but it then was the world to be changed. One. Yes. How many people have you inspired to do this? Because to me, it sounds like fresh hell. Oh, does it? Yeah. Yeah. I really? would like. Yeah. I would like nothing less than that. Swanee, it was the greatest thing that we have mm. ever done. Sell it, and we've done some good stuff. Yeah. Well, you can read the book. Yes. I dropped the book off to you when you had COVID. Yes, I know, I know. And chicken soup. But not everybody has. No, correct. Well, I don't know why we, why we, we, I don't even know, and I I talk about that in the book, I don't know why we had the idea to Mm. do it. Yeah. But it wasn't like, you know, ding. Mm. It was just something that we kind of discovered we were on the same page And sometimes, about. don't you find that sometimes ideas like that, brave and crazy ideas, once they're in your head, there's almost a sense of, oh, no, now we have to do this. Well, also because you couldn't shake it. Yes. Once you'd had the idea, yeah. 
it was, and Peter kept saying to me, you're not going to give up work. There's no way you'll stop working. And not in kind of a passive aggressive way, probably mm. in a we can use the money way. Yeah. <laughs> 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 uh, but I was like, I will. Yeah. I just know that I will. And telling Husey was just, that Ooh, was really like, hard. Yeah. That was harder than telling my parents that we of were course. going away. But you didn't stop work though because I Husey did the first talked you out. Yeah, he did. How long yeah, before? How long were you there before you went into lockdown? Before the world changed? A year. So you had a so year. So we'd though. already stay. Decided to stay. We decided to stay for the second year. To stay for another year, like in March of the first year. Peter and I were. I'm going to speak foreign. Walking across the piazza. <laughs> 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 Thank you. And I said to Peter, I'm not going to be ready to go home at the end of the year. And he said, neither will I. Right. And then this is unheard of to you married blokes. We kissed. Oh. What? Wow. Yeah. yeah. Public yeah. child wow. of, in Italy. Uh, affection. Jeez. Oh, yeah. In Italy, you can totally do it. <laughs> and then so it? we, but we kept it from the kids for a while. Mm. The kiss. No. <laughs> the um, when we broke the news to them, it was it was really terrible. Oh, was it? They, oh, it was they, they to well, They didn't want to be there for one year, let alone two. Well, Is that right? especially Lewis, our eldest, who by the time we left, so people who were thinking of doing this, mm. you know, like I was saying to to. Carrie. Yeah, so Carrie's gone to England yeah. for a few months and yeah. I definitely I love the way you say that you. as though people don't know that. You're Not everybody does know. That's one thing I've learned really? in this business. Yeah, 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 actually that's the true. The minute you assume someone knows something, they don't. Oh my God, I've signed so many books as you. <laughs> <laughs> that is actually <laughs> spot on. There you go. So many what? people think yeah. I'm Chrissy. Why yeah. did you what? feel the need to uh, put a photo of Sam Pang in your book? You were at Lawrence Mooney's wedding. Sales. Yes. Uh, and sales uh, is yeah. Sales. Yes. <laughs> like, He's got you, such you, you could not get a more wankerish photo of Sam. Show me, show me. Have a look at him. Oh, my God. Like, what, a, what a tosser. He yeah, looks myself. like sugar daddies. He That's does. how he looks on holidays. I know. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I'm relaxed. glad I don't go on holidays with you. This is work, <laughs> this is work me. So we, and we had some time in Italy too. Yeah, it was we wonderful. did. So we the moon's had... looks cool. Lima, right, not but... so much. Sheer girl rocks that <laughs> Once hat. Once again, I'm going to say, Mooney, put it the in podcast. the podcast. <laughs> the pain looks terrible. <laughs> have you seen? Have you seen um, or been on the show uh, when Chrissy's been hosting the? No, project because at... I do it Tuesday night. Mm. What do you do it Tuesday? And night? I'm for, I'm a fourth. Oh, you don't. Right, yeah, you but don't have to... Swanee's in the hot seat. She's a big dog now. Yeah, yeah. Is, yeah. yeah. How do you top. think she handled the hot seat? Because have you got it, Dino? Absolutely. You know, I like, heard the pivot. Can we play it again? Yeah, please. I'm going to be the world's oldest housemate. I'm going to be like 95 years old, living in a share house in Brunswick, running after some 30 year olds who ate my hummus. I can't wait. <laughs> What's his name? <laughs> Russia is once again being accused of war crimes after hundreds of bot- war crimes. Too. Really hard it's because terrible. it's the pivots. Oh. The pivots are like dancing with the stars. Mm. <laughs> yes. Which you have done? I have done. It's my only reality show. Hey, we're going to get to ads, but you're not going anywhere. Don't move. Kate Langbrook's here. This is the Chrissy Sam and Brownie podcast. Chrissy Sam and Brownie on Nova 100. Kate Langbrook's here the for Queen. the first time. Uh, the Queen has returned. She was the in the Queen studio for returned. 12 years. How's it feel? How's it feel? Mm, it's better than off with her head. What is this? Isn't it? Well, don't worry, I heard from a listener about it. We were four years into our show, and uh, I said, hey, who do you work for? I said, yeah, I work on the Nova Brecky show. <laughs> Someone said, yeah, I love Kate Langbrook. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, people have got really no idea, like no you idea. were saying before. Mate, I still Absolutely. get mail for Husey. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, don't you? What does it say? Is it, is it great mail? What does it say? What do yeah, they say, yeah. the letters? Very complimentary. <laughs> hey, I've got some questions, all right? I've got some very, I've got some questions that just, you know, punchy, okay. punchy. Right. Yep. So as yep. we all know, you did this show for 12 years right mm. yeah but when i and it was uh, but i remember listening it was Husey, kate and dave right yeah that's how it started yeah mm. so why'd you get rid of dave o'neill well what because happened? they took him to go to to the Smooth. new radio station yeah, but you were in started. a position of power where you could have kept him if you wanted to so why did you leave him why did you let him leave oh, i can only assume he wanted to go did you dog him what does that mean? Did you? <laughs> Very, I may well have, Strange but I don't know what it means. Did you and Husey like squeeze out? Yeah, why Dave? did you get rid of our boys? No, he funny went me- to Vega to be, because he wanted to be. You know what? Because they're two 
leading men, oh, yeah. there's always a frisson oh, between them. Okay. And Dave wanted to be the star of the show, so he went to Vega to be the star of the show. How'd that work out? <laughs> and I had the greatest two years ever. I had the greatest yeah. two years Is ever. Yeah, he's fabulous. delightful. Is that smooth? It's smooth now. I think yeah. it was something in between. I want to say oh, classic yeah. rock. I classic think rock. you're right. Yeah, yeah, it was classic rock. I all think right. you're right. All right, hey, listen. Yeah. Pun- punchy, this is not the three pm pickup, all right? Okay. We've got Hang a- on, I'm cutting up some cake I made. Oh, excuse me, you've obviously, you've just shown your petticoat there. You've obviously never listened to the 3 pm pickup because there is no punchier show. Uh, it is, a, it is, a, we it are. Is punchy. Are you right? It is. Well, because really you know, punchy. I was the first person on the 3 yes. pm pickup. Yes. So I know exactly how it works. It was yes. it was a joy. It's as loose as a goose. Loose as a goose. Oh, yeah, loose, yeah. loose, but that is loose. Yeah. And we have the best time. I'm sure you do when you get to phone it in every day. Do you know what I mean? Not actually putting any You know what? In at all. Do you know what? I let me just say this. As <laughs> don't, I say get to my don't get mad no, at me. No, no, I'm not mad. Don't let him distract you when from you cutting that cake. When you point a finger up. at yourself, there's three fingers pointing back at you. <laughs> What she's yeah. saying there, Sam, is that you, you phone, phone it in. <laughs> just in case you missed it. I, I had missed it. <laughs> now, earlier this morning my phone went off and I, I was waiting for you guys to say, oh, the rules are if, a, if your phone goes off and you get a text from someone, Buy you've got to read it out. Well, you've got to read, read it out on out. air. Yeah, I know. <gasps> Absolutely. But it was from you and it was a video of you baking. Yeah, um, I got up first thing in the morning. And she was baking. Kate Langbrook, magnificent. Yeah, you and you got any good Swanee in the kitchen? and I talk. Would you do the do food chef? talk? No. Don't no. cut your finger off. Of yeah, no. careful your thumb. I'm left-handed. It disturbs people. You've I'm made a you've made okay. a wonderful cake with sort of br- toasted almonds, almonds on, on top. Flaked you know what it is? A, let's see if we can flaked, see my. They are. Let's you're holding see if we that, can you're see. holding that knife like Major Gary Swan <laughs> used to in the war. It's really <laughs> appropriate. The killing machine. <laughs> <laughs> I'm seeing if I've got. Some did you hear that segment? Apple. And apart from I them did. inferring that somehow I'm related to Major Major Gary Robert Smith, <laughs> um, <laughs> that? I don't well, know that is what you're inferring. Oh, right. Weren't oh, they? Oh, weren't, not. That weren't they sweet? Are you joking? They sliced. Apple. We were not. Oh, right. Weren't they sweet messages from they my were dear? Beautiful. Dad. I know, it's beautiful. Mm, All it. right, so I've just been handed a piece of apple cake. I've been wanting to try this cake. This is I was going to make oh, it for you last get year. Get into it, Swanee. I grabbed. A knife. I grabbed a knife and plates, but I didn't grab anything to eat it with. So while you're tasting it, while you're tasting it, while you're while you're tasting and serving it, it, don't you worry. Husey and Kate's punching above his weight winners. What was that? What was punching above his weight as part of the as part of the promotion? Bryn Edelston rode a tram for the first time. I don't think it's any good. Kate, get it into you. Dino, Dino, do you want some? some? I want a double You're slice. You're just a side show, Oh, yeah, there's a big fat one so here. How you? did you do that? Oh, no, don't tell us. I tell, told, tell me. No, you know there. what it is? It's Mary Berry. What's that? You know that she's, um, like I you. think, uh, what's that cooking show in England? <laughs> The, the great, that they the do great, here. Great, bake off, great, bake off. Oh. Yeah, Antiques Roadshow. <laughs> <laughs> How do you get those sliced apples in the middle? Are they, do they go in raw or cooked? Yeah, they go in raw. Oh, wow. And then you put the batter on. It's so good, isn't it? Oh! <gasps> And because I'm Dutch, I like an apple cake. No food. I'm not yeah. Dutch. <laughs> I could also say because I'm Dutch, I like a, a shoe carved out of wood. But yet not. No, it's good. And a oh tall man. Labor, labor for the tall podcast. Man, the tallest people. <laughs> 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 the tallest people in the world, the Dutch. Well, well listen, uh, this oh. is just a dream come true. We've never been in the same studio oh. together, and oh, it's oh, just like the most What's, natural, that's wonderful. That's true. I've never, you've never had us on your. I've never been on your radio show mm. and all that. We years. invite you on the three pm pick up all the time. I it's an open mm. invitation. Actually, I don't that's get that. a lie. I have been in here. I don't get you. that invite. That doesn't make it to me. It doesn't get to me. Mm. I, I'd love to come in. Your people must run what, interference. What, what's the most Shouts. memorable or the craziest thing? You did when you were on this show. Mm. 12 years. Can you maybe do any wacky stunts? What do you remember? Um, I remember our last show more than anything because we did it in a theatre. Athenaeum. Mm, really? At the Ath. Yeah. Did you and we uh, had like, I don't know, 900 people there. You were, it was geez, just fantastic. You were lowered the from the ceiling. Yeah, I was <laughs> lowered. <laughs> like pink. In the what? finale. <laughs> in the finale. Oh, and I you got, were dressed in something amazing. Uh, we'd, done, we'd sung a song. For some reason, we'd <laughs> sung Thai Yellow Ribbon Around the Old Oak Tree and all our kids <laughs> came on stage and that, for some reason they were wearing lederhosen. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> and, and then at the end, I got 
pulled up onto the into the rafters yes. with a harness on and a <laughs> trap door opened and Husey went down to hell. And when he, as the trap door opened and the red flames consumed him, I said, say hi to Matt and Joe for me. <laughs> <laughs> because that's how it was in those days. <laughs> So, no, uh, it was great. That's cool. Oh, shit. <laughs> it was oh, great. But I don't think we were that mad. We were just like, I like remember you guys. Listening to we that just show. loved, I loved it. it. We um, had fun. We yeah. love you. It's so, it's such a thrill to see you. It, the, the book has obviously book. gone gangbusters. And there's Ciao, not, Bella. Not too many Reprint, people. Reprint, second edition. I think so. Oh, I think so. But that just means they printed eight the first time. <laughs> <laughs> just take the photo out of Sam, will you? Mate, I know that no it's... image clearance, by the way. <laughs> Didn't even ask me. I know that it sounds tacky and whatever, but Mother's Day is coming up, and if you're desperate, uh, you, if you if you're like, oh god, I don't know what to get. I love it. that. If you're desperate, if you're desperate. If you're Desperate, well, I, I, and you know where that comes from? Ten pairs of slippers. That comes from like, God, what do you get your mum? What do you get your mum? Hey. What do you get your mum? This is a great, great idea. She will laugh. She will cry. She'll be inspired. She feel a great deal of regret that she never travelled to Italy with her family. I, I, she, I, I don't. Dad. She may not feel regret about. That. Are you happy? Are you happy you came in this morning? I'm so happy. I've loved it. Please don't go just yet. I love you all. Love Individually you. and Kate collectively. That doesn't always happen. Have some more. I will be. Don't Kate worry about that. Kate amazing. Mm. Kate Langbrook, we love you. Love you. For Chrissy, Sam and Brownie, Ripper Show will be back tomorrow. Chrissy, Sam and Brownie, oh, unless it's a weekend. Here is a 100.